Okay. Today is a humid day. <laughs> yeah, it's very humid. We are trying to get to Muzhan. And so it says here that it's 400 meters away. I'm trying to get my bearings. Okay, so it is in this direction. Alright, so we go here. We are walking again today. Um, just for the just for the first destination because it says here that it's 400 meters away. And yeah, Muzhan is a specialty coffee store that sells gears. Yeah, so we're going to look for gears that we don't have in the Philippines. Hey, okay, here we go. Uh, the hotel that I'm staying at right now, that, that's a check-in hotel. It's a very nice hotel that is in a nice neighborhood. Uh, this is the city center, Zhongzheng uh, district. It's almost near to most of the coffee shops here in Taipei. Like yesterday, I went to two of the most popular coffee shops here. Simple Cafe and VWI by Chad Wang. And I just walked. They're only two kilometers away. So right now I'm going to the Muzhan, Muzan. They pronounce it differently here. But the but but the spelling is Muzhan coffee. It's 400 meters away and we did while talking to you I did 100 meters already. Um there are a lot of restaurants also around. So you will not run out of options of where to eat. We should turn left right here. Hanko Street. Ooh. Parang ang sarap nun. Um, parang siyang uh, toasted shopao. We need to cross again and then 200 more meters also the train station is not far from where I'm staying it's very near I have the red line um, near me walking distance it's uh, it's actually the nearest um, train station to me the NTU hospital station and then I also have the blue uh, blue line, the Banan line, is very close to me as well. Maybe 20, maybe 15 minute walk away from my hotel. Yeah, the hotel that where I'm staying at is very, very accessible. There are also bus stations, but I guess it's, I think it's harder for, for me to travel by bus. Mainly because um, I don't really know where I'm going. So I don't know where to, what to anticipate, where to stop, where to go down. It's easier for me to, it's easier for me to just travel by train because it's very, uh, very objective. You have the train stations, like the stop stations is easier for me, yeah. For me at least. Not saying it's easy for for everyone, but for me at least it's easier. It's a very busy street. I think there are a lot of offices here. And I think this is a mall.
Middle Suji massage. <laughs> okay, we're almost there, 70 meters away. Uh, this is the Mutsan Zhongzheng branch. We are in the Zhongzheng district. There are, I think there are three different Mutsan stores. So, if I'm not mistaken, there is one in Shimending. And there is one here. I don't know where the, uh, where the third one is. Oh, is this the place? Oh, there! There is Mutsan. Right, look, oh, it's very iconic. We made it. There, Mutsan Coffee Beans Equipment. Right. Let's go in and let's take a look around. Hello, can I video inside? Yes. This is this is glitch glitch edition of the V60, and they have the puzzle here. Do you call it puzzle here as well? Yeah. Oh, pulsar. Oh, the V60 glitch is very cheap. Oh, it's only oh, one one seventy. This is ceramic, right? What? Ceramic. Yeah, ceramic. Very nice. <laughs> And only here, I think. Only here? The glitch? Ah, me? Me from Philippines. We don't have this one in the Philippines. <laughs> Yo, yes. Even this one. No in the Philippines. They have really nice collectible V60s here. This one? Ah, uh, this one? Yes. The glitch? Yeah. And they have arrow presses, fellow penguin. Oh, penguin. Penguin kettle. They also have siphon. And they have nice... Oh, this is Minos. Minos um, milk jug. They have different kinds of paper servers. Oh, they have a different... They have a diff. This is not Pegasus. This is not Kalita either. This is Hario. But the inside looks like a Kalita. It doesn't look like a Pegasus. And it is stone. I'm telling you now. This is the place to go when you visit Taiwan. Mutsan. What's the What's the name again? Mutsan Coffee. Yeah. Mutsan. Okay. Mutsan. Yeah. Mutsan Beans Equipment. Right. Because they have the, all this. Um, really nice items here. Hasami. I've seen this in a lot of uh, coffee shops. This is very popular here, I think. Really nice carafes. This looks like a Kinto, but it's different. They have the Kogu um, kettle here as well. And the Hario Outdoor, the Zebrang, um, Zebrang kettles, and even the Outdoor steel outdoor kettles okay and they roast their own coffees as well and they have a lot of different papers here they have Kalita the cafe and this one I don't even know the brand of this one and Pegasus filters Kono Kono papers and the Hario papers all right, so I'm gonna shop for now. I'll get back to you in a bit, bye. Right, so our trip to 
Moz Han is very successful. Um, I didn't buy. I didn't buy a lot, but I got the Lily foldable crank handle for a commandante. And also I got the hoop. Hoop dripper that I've been eyeing since I started doing specialty coffee. And I bought filters. I got a lot of filters. Yeah, I bought a lot of filters. Um, he said that the filters are really fast um, actually second to second to cafe filters and yeah the guy the guy inside is very very nice he doesn't he doesn't want to be filmed um, he doesn't want to be photographed as well but yeah he's very nice he gave me coffee free coffee again and yeah that's it for the Moose Han. Um, I'll put the link down in the description below. If you are staying in Zhongzheng district, you might want to visit his shop. It's very near. It's very close to where I'm staying at right now. And yeah, it's a nice, it's a nice district. It's a shopping district actually. So it's not a waste of your time if you visit his place. All right, for now, thank you so much for watching. In the next videos, I'm gonna show you more about coffee. Bye!